Hey everybody and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Rebirth, Afterbirth, all the things. We're trying to do Eve again. Just trying to get to and defeat Hush. Uh, while that might be an interesting item to have, um, um, no. <laughs> Bomb bag is an interesting start. I actually should have considered it. Would have been able to get more tinted rocks. I said I'd check them, so that's what I'm doing. Oh, whoopsie. I held out an hour for too long. Oops, well, chances are I'm not living, yeah, I'm not living through this room, so <laughs> we'll just call it there. Even if there had been an awesome item in that chest, I probably would have been screwed. Capricorn. Oh, that's Leo. I was actually about to take another hit, so... Oops, restarted. I was gonna head towards it, but... If you hold down R, it's like it starts registering... Okay, it's a damage up and an HP up. It's an unfilled HP up. It's more to trade to the devil. One makes you small. I am okay with being made small. This is an XL though. So it's going to be challenging. But I have to not take damage. Wait, was this an XL? I need to check actually. If so... It doesn't feel like an XL just based on the rooms that I'm currently seeing. Okay, well that means we're doing this. Shoot. It's not what I explicitly wanted. I want the soul heart for the bosses. Just in case. That was close. Did not do very much damage. That was close. I really oh, damn it. I will go. Go, bird. Go. Do the bird thing. Bird! Oh my god, bird. Are you really that dense, bird? Bird! Oh my god. There, finally. Sorry. The AI on the bird is really annoying. At least I got hit by one of the half damage tiers. Okay, so that gives me a black heart and three bomb drops. One of which happens to be a, a uh, troll bomb in this case. I'm really glad- oh my gosh, stop it. I think we'll be able to take him out before he deals a heart and a half damage to me. The fires helped, but they didn't, uh... 
but I managed to clear his stuff without him, and he killed himself. Alright, so meets an HP up. I'm not happy with this at all. Yeah, I picked up Brother Bobby. I wanted to pick up the collar. Alright, bomb profits a thing. I'm not going tech two. I can't. I it reduces your damage by 65% and then it deals ten it does damage ten times a second. I just call this a victory and wow well that okay it all paid off in the end unfortunately I don't know any way of getting rid of red hearts I need to get rid of one more red heart I don't know if this is a mistake, but because I've got the most soul hearts right now, I figured it was the best course of action. What? Oh, I backed into one of the other slow ones. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I'm not getting a double deal on this floor. What? Oh my god. I'm done. I'm not doing that. I'm playing so horribly that... no. I do not want to start an XL. I don't even want that. I need to be able to get into Horror Babylon. Eve is so useless without being Horror Babylon. Okay, contract from below. That's really good. Or, well, it'll make it so that we're not hurting for resources, like, ever. Alright, when I leave this room, I'll be cursed. Right there. What a horrible night to have a curse. I got too many HP ups in, in the, on the XL4. Like, almost anything else would have been better. But we're not going to be hurting for resources like ever now. Presuming I don't die. Th this is the danger now. And that's supposed to be the danger of the character, the inherent risk reward. Alright, so what do we got? Tell me what I have. What have I won? Cricket's head. I would start that. So I think this was a very, very good start. I think we're going to be fine. Batteries that I can't use. Okay, this is a soul heart actually, which is awesome. This, this should drop a soul heart when killed. And a tears and shot speed up. Beautiful. Beautiful first floor. We can do it. I don't have the keys to open all those. I'm very surprised that worked. Excuse me. I pretty much one shot all flies. The 1.5 damage multiplier from Cricket's head is gorgeous. Sacrifice room, which I will not be using at moment or at the present because we don't have a health. Another big room. It'd be really nice if I had a use item. Like, you're camouflaged pretty well, I'll grant you that, but not well enough. Pumping out some real damage here. Eh, holy water's not really my jam. But, I might as well have it. 
Uh, when you take damage, it breaks on the ground. And uh, anything that walks over it takes damage. Which is, it's not insignificant damage either. It's actually quite substantial. If I take enough damage, I will spawn a dark familiar. And at every room, I can spawn two to four kamikaze flies, which do two times my damage. And we're moving. I'm not a big fan of Curse of the Lost, but we're doing good, so I'm not particularly sad. Oh wow, that was bad on my part. PhD makes all pills good. Well, it gets rid of bad pills, which there are neutral pills. Like, that's an important thing to note. But it also lets me see what all pills are without having used them before. Uh, it's actually a pretty useful item, but. It still doesn't mean that your pill rotation is going to be good, which is the sucky part. Judgment. This could be top secret room. It's not, but could have been. Have I been to the item? I haven't been to the item room on this floor. Uh, I probably sh shouldn't have gone to the devil fight, or to the fight, because uh, if I get a devil room, I can't actually buy anything. This is the gritty that can only spawn stuff, so. Well, unless I get an HP up. Rather have Guppy's head or the Satanic Bible. Satanic Bible, I'd slowly gain health over time. You know what? Let's go with that. Guppy's head's good. I like Guppy's head a lot. But I also want to gain health. And I want to gain health slowly over time because if I am gaining health, well, A, I want to have no soul hearts. Or no red hearts. That's something I'm. I did. I did stop here. So we're out. Um, but yeah, I want to have no red hearts, number one. And I picked up the scab so I could, you know, do that. But also, this will allow me to maybe later on in the game hit a sacrifice room a little bit harder. So I currently have four soul hearts. I need to track that. Technically one black. But My damage is doing just fine. I've already touched Guppy's head, so if I become Guppy, I should be set. Don't really have any incentive to go to the arcade. Uh, I will risk going to the first room. I didn't realize I was going to pick that up. I have 22 bombs now. Yeah, I'll take Head of Keeper. Head of the Keeper means I shoot coins now. And when I think they hit enemies or... Oh, wow. Or kill enemies. 
there's a chance that they will drop a coin. One day I'll have to put a lot of effort into getting my donation machine back up to where it was. See? I think it's on kill. I'm building up keys. This appears to be the right direction. I got enough bombs. I don't need them. Oh, nice damage up. This is definitely the right direction. I'm at three and a half. Now four and a half. Here and Queen is a rough fight. And this was pooping like nobody's business. Okay, it's on an angle. And it's dead. I can take the 1 HP up, even though I haven't seen a devil deal. And I can bank it for next time, basically. Could have all... We've got a lot of places where that couldn't have been it, because we couldn't reach there. It's like, this could be the secret room. Being pretty mean, fortune teller machine. I haven't been to the item room, and I am feeling like I'm doing pretty good in terms of progression here. Nice. That was bad. In for me, a chance that when we get hit by a tier, it blocks it basically. We glow a slight blue if that ever happens. Wow. Wow. I'm bad. <laughs> I am bad. At least I didn't hit any of the red poop in this room. Alright, we've got a whole bunch of time. Dark Bum would be kind of a dream. Dark Bum's always a dream, though. Okay, that's as many bombs as you want. However, you have to take a damage to get that. However, there's two batteries in there, which is ironic because that's two health, so it's actually profit for me to go in there. Uh, normally I don't like taking that, but... It's so, like, this is pure profit. So, as long as I don't pick up red hearts now, I've got a giant mass of wealth pay to the deal, to, to the devil. Dang it, I was hoping you that one wouldn't actually be able to get me. On the positive side, the black hearts are... I'm getting them. <laughs> I think that uh, I would have died if I had kept with Guppy's head. I'm doing terrible in terms of not taking damage. Which is, you know, an important part of doing this properly. By the way, I have as many bombs as I want this for, so... Bombing all of these is basically a requirement. 
finding the top secret room is also going to be something I do. None of these are currently... Well, this could be the secret room? Maybe. I'm not sure. But it doesn't really matter. Those are most likely not it. Oh, wow. You know, I don't know what Black Feather does, but I might as well hold on to it, right? We still have a shop and an item room to find. So I might as well go find him. Not, I'll touch it. D10 rerolls enemies. Supposedly that changed to being from the current floor. I realized what I was about to do. That's funny. It's an Emperor card. Counterfeit penny. A chance that every time you pick up a penny, it's actually worth an extra coin. I feel like the black feather is... Uh, gosh darn it. Some uh, a damage thing, which I'd rather have a damage thing. Two Emperor cards and Hematomesis. Um, Hematomesis could be super useful, is the only problem. Like, and I mean super useful. It could let me get down to one red heart if I pick up stuff on accident and can't trade things away. So I think I have to stick with Hematomesis. As a principle. If, it, if I weren't playing as Eve, then I would be taking the Emperor cards. But I need to go back for the Eve to spell. Not worth. I also need to be careful that I don't accidentally burn through a ton of time. Like, yes, I'm ahead, but that doesn't mean I can't be behind very quickly. This was wrong. I mean, we are getting the uh, the secondary benefit of us clearing rooms, giving us uh, charges, which is effectively health, as well as killing enemies, giving us money. We're just hitting. Oh my god, more health up pills. I'm greedy. I'm being super greedy. Health up. But it's just more reason that I... Oh, Infamy activated. It's just more reason that I really need to keep that Hematomesis spell for if I do something stupid. I probably have too many red hearts right now. Like, just... In general, I stepped on the creep. Stupid creep. Wow. Sniping bastard. I'm fast enough that that didn't kill me. I'm honestly surprised. Well, might as well take this. Might as well take this. That is another health up pill. I'm not that greedy. Look, I'm greedy. I'm not that greedy. I right, should be able to find the secret room as well, which I believe should be right here. Oh, nice! I got an Incubus! So, I took enough damage to spawn a Dark Familiar. That was um, Cambian Conception that I picked up. Uh, which then was immediately worth it because I have an Incubus. And I've got BFFs, which means that not only does the Incubus deal my damage, it is then affected by BFFs and deals twice my damage. So I'm now going to absolutely wreck stuff. Basically, I just got a three times damage multiplier. A little bit more nuanced than that because the Incubus fires its own and is unfortunately behind uh, the Holy Water, but still. Please die, Krampus. 
Lump of coal. Very nice. We're kicking ass and taking names. Curse of Darkness, kind of annoying. Could be worse though. We got a really tiny one of these dudes. I probably shouldn't pay the two keys. I think it probably ends up being worth it though. That was unfortunate that red heart, but it is a 2-4, so there could be an arcade here somewhere. But I'm still doing okay, even without the damage multiplier where I need it to be, or where I want it to be, I should say. Lost fly, nobody really cares, but I could get closer to Beelzebub. Pays for itself, that's about it. Actually, it gives me one charge for my use item, so it's arguably profit. That was a pretty good bomb placement, if you ask me. Oh, thank you, Infamy. Infamy uh, blocked the one, one tier. I'm gonna be really sad now if I can't uh, trade away this health to the devil. I'm a little too slow for that room. Oh wow. I didn't even see that one. So super gre- oh wow. Okay, well, on the positive side, I'm not gonna feel bad or too bad about this. Because I'll have money to spend- oh my gosh. I just took so much damage. Well, as I said, on the positive side, I won't have to worry about wasting charges of the book of or the Satanic Bible. Just inching in and then backing out. shot at my own fly because I can't tell. I can still one-shot these guys with my base tiers, so that's still a thing, luckily. Oh, this is the depths too, though, so I don't want to go just yet. I really miss the, uh, prevalence of goat head. Like, it used to be everywhere. You used to get it all the time. And now you don't see it very much. Man, I didn't realize how much I was missing the speed. Wait. I have seen everything that I was interested in, so let's go. I was thinking I hadn't seen the shop, but because it was super greed. My brain kind of messed up on that one. Alright, options for top secret room. Not here, so we'll just go. This is Red Mom. You can really tell from the doors more than anything else. I just need to trade some of this health away. As I said, I got greedy. Uh, Bloody Lust would be interesting, but not worth the time that I'd spent fighting it. So we're off. With not a moment to spare. Well, for boss rush, anyway. Oh, hello. That's hilarious.
It was actually placed really poorly. <laughs> the bomb knocked them basically onto the spikes. Well, close enough to the spikes that opening them put them onto the spikes. That was unfortunate. Oh, this room is abysmal. Lost fly is continuing to be lost. Oh, dang it. One day I might just break even on health loss. I... I didn't know where these... These things go in some of the craziest directions. crap out of this thing. Okay, I want to make use of both of those. Lost fly, I don't even know what to tell you. It was worth a check. I'm gonna have to backtrack quite a bit, unfortunately. To use those batteries effectively. Like, quite a bit. And I don't have much speed. I'm going to do it because I think it's worth it. Using batteries efficiently, especially when your batteries are effectively health. Those are effectively hearts, but they could have been two or three hearts depending on what I chose. Got to book it back to the to the forefront of discovery. Well, I now have something better than the Satanic Bible, arguably, especially because I'm now two thirds guppy. Thing is, I could just go... No, we'll see. I really don't need to take any of this, I really just need to go. you guys I'm now seeing a lot of giant champions one makes you larger I'll keep with what I got Take a mom's knife. You'll not make me do it. Just like you'll not make me take the one that makes me a larger pill. Alright, so here's what I think. Oh, here's what I'm thinking. Um, I think I'm gonna paw again one more time. Oopsie. I'll paw one more time and take back this. I'm now at one red heart. I probably won't take any more health ups, because I'm looking to get rid of this one. There's one more solid possible deal with a devil chance, um, which is next floor. 
And we're just gonna run with it. Except I'm stupid, so whatever. Oh god, I almost took the knife. I walked straight into the knife pedestal. Oh, that would've been such a, such a disappointment. Alright, Curse of the Lost is bad. I kinda wish I now had that Emperor card, but... Oh, I took enough damage that I got a little brim. Hi, little brim. So, yeah. It was totally strats. I totally did that on purpose. Little Brim is too far back for me to actually be able to aim. More unfortunate. I've got four minutes, so it could be worse. I think this way is the correct way, but I'm a little lost right now. important. I needed to kill the thing or it would have just spawned more. Not worth. Took more damage than I wanted to there. I really want to get down to Polaroid invincibility. Two golden bombs, that's kind of hilarious. Mostly because two golden bombs is pointless. And you only need one. No, 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 I want this. I'll take an Empress card. It's a nice damage up. I could use it. Alright, we've traveled on such a long path that if this isn't the boss, I will have no idea where the boss is. And it will take me forever to get back to where it is. Okay, pin. Yep. Boss acquired. With two minutes to spare. I don't know if there's a little part. Darn it. Oh, she's firing the rapid fire shots right at me. No deal with the devil, which kind of sucks because that means I'm stuck with this red heart. Unless I find a way to get rid of it, which I don't think I can. This is a Joker card. It's a two of diamonds card. Wow. So, Firemind or Four Wave Shooter Friend. Another tinted rock. Lots of tinted rocks. Thing is, I've got BFFs. Uh, 
Alright, let's see if I can repay this at least back up past 23, I think is where it was. Or 34? One second. I doubt it'll pay out this much. If it takes this much money, then awesome. But holy water doesn't want you to know how much money it's currently at. So, bear that in mind. There it goes. Finally jams. It probably went decently high. I've got BFFs, so I'm taking these. Uh, what does Tammy's head look like? Yeah, no. It's not worth it. Okay, my range isn't that good. Be money littering the ground. All right, let's do this. The shot height on these shots is stupid. So high. Just look at how far everything is from the shadows compared to mine. Mine, the shadows are right below. And I do mean like right below. Everything hush fires is at least two or three times that. Oh, this is a cool attack. I like that. I love how the floor is just littered with money because of the head of the keeper. So the real question is going to be whether or not we can make Mega Satan a thing. Because we easily crush Mega Satan in a fight. I found a safe area, so I'm just going to sit here. Found another safe area, so I'm just going to sit here. These are safe area attacks, they just fire in a, such a pattern that if you find a place where you don't get hit, then you won't ever get hit by that attack. And every which way he fires, I am in a safe zone. So as long as he keeps doing this attack, I will never be hit. Now of course he's going to switch it up. But all four directions, I found a safe spot for all four directions that he fires that attack. Those are interesting. Okay, time to move. He's almost dead though, so and he hit me once. Or was it twice? Well, I no longer know where the safe safe spot is, but it looks like I found it again. Ah, dang. Almost got him before he hit me a second time. A Thame has appeared in the basement. I've heard about this one. This is one of the ones that showed up in uh, the PAX preview for Afterbirth, I think. But we're going up. Going up. After this, pretty much everything in the game is just going to be a pushover, so I'm going to be full clearing this floor looking for a sacrifice room. If I die... Wow, I have like no keys, I just realized. I want to save four for the chest, or I'm going to have a bad time. Strength card is good for stealing deals with the devil. I mean, everything else that I ever face is going to be a pushover from this point on, so... I mean, I killed Hush, which is arguably the hardest boss in the game. Certainly one of the m more mechanically challenging bosses. Oh, I guess that wasn't a fighting room, so it doesn't count.
trying uh I'm trying to get my incubus in there. Because the incubus does so much damage. And the incubus is literally doing twice my damage. There's not much I can say to that except, you know, well played incubus. You managed to do twice my damage. Alright, well that's full health. Now I can try and work on making them all black health, I suppose. Um, for now, for now, although, yeah, no. Okay, we got a sacrifice room, everybody. By being blessed, I'm guaranteed to deal with the angel. Unless I've already gotten a deal with the devil, I think. So the thing is, I need health. Fairly desperately to continue doing the thing that I'm doing. And there we go, this is also a Mega Satan run. We've got the key, so I no longer need to harvest... Oh, I no longer need to hurt myself. Unfortunately, I need to find some way of hurting myself, because I accidentally picked up an Eternal Heart. Which means I'll lose my Horror of Babylon, which I don't think will really matter. But I'd like for it to not matter. Or I'd like to keep it. We just have to find Isaac now. And take him to school. Infamy just activated, so thank you. I can still spawn one more Dark Familiar from Cambian Conception if I take enough hits. The taking enough hits part, we'll see. It might happen. I might not have the health to take enough hits. I think the number is known, I just don't know it. Oh god, that little one's so tiny and fast. Alright, I'm totally lacking keys, which kind of sucks. But I think I, I traded a key for a soul heart each, which I think is worth it. Chances of getting keys once I'm in the chest is significantly reduced. I'm dropping the left hand. Nice, got a soul heart for that. Oh, I'm gonna be sad. Yeah, I'm gonna go kill Isaac, because that'll top off my, uh, my charge. If I do the big room, it gives me two, and I don't want to do the big room and waste, waste one, basically. Infamy activated again. Fast enough to completely dodge that, which is pretty nice. You're safe in either corner on the other side from your starts, but you're only safe in one of the corners on the side that he does start. I believe it's the bottom. Alright, so let's go ahead and clear that other big room. I'm looking for tinted rocks and keys, basically. I mean, this would be the room, but, you know, whatever. Mm 
Yikes. I mean, we're melting anything and everything we come in contact with, so I'm fairly certain that Mega Satan isn't going to matter. That was unfortunate, but... I could get shoop to it, but I got the two keys that I needed. I'm not going to open that. I have no reason to. I've got the keys I need, at the very least. I'm probably... Probably not going to explore the chest. Past the first room. It's probably not going to happen. I lose my horror Babylon. Sad day. I used the strength card. We're just gonna crush his face. Bring it on! I forgot that I can't fly for a second. Darn it. It would be really sad if I died to this fight. I've already gotten hit more in this fight than I did in the hush fight. Mostly because I'm being kind of reckless. Envy, you shall be defeated. I don't know what even hit me. Oh, pride. Between pride and gluttony, they basically make it so you can't go in the correct direction. After the angels. They have quite a bit of health, just not enough. I think the patterns are the same thing. Yeah, the patterns are actually the same as the white angels. They're just black. There we go. Now we put him into his skull phase. Oh wow, this attack is insane. Silly, but it's another safe spot attack. We're doing a massive amount of damage. And it's just over. Quick, quick, grab the money, grab the money! We already have 99 cents. Okay, we got Horror Baby and Lil Baby. Horror Baby. Little baby. I know that because the Steam achievements pop up in the right, uh, the bottom right hand corner. You guys don't get to see that just because of the way that I am recording. So if that really is something that bothers you, I can change it, but it seems rather insignificant. Um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Uh, it took us a little bit to get Eve going, but we, when we did, we got a really solid run that managed to make both Hush and Mega Satan, which is pretty solid, and I'm happy with that uh, in the end. So yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you next time.